Yes, General Scaparotti, um, you mentioned in your testimony the concern about Turkey acquiring the S-400 at the same time they're supposed to take delivery of the um, F-35s. And I know that there has been an effort underway to try and um, encourage Turkey to look at other alternatives and that there was an offer made early in January for the sale of the Patriot system. They have until the end of March, it's my understanding, to decide whether they're going to take delivery of that or not. But the question I have is if Turkey moves forward with the agreement with Russia on the S-400, do we assume that they should receive delivery of the F-35s? And what does that do to, to their um, accessing that technology? Senator, I would say, first of all, if they accept the S-400 and uh, to establish it uh, within Turkey, I, there's, first of all, an issue of that it's not interoperable uh, with NATO systems, nor is it interoperable inside of our integrated air missile defense system. So that presents one problem. The second has to do with the F-35. It presents a problem to all of our aircraft, but specifically the F-35, I believe. And I would, my best military advice would be that we don't, um, we don't then uh, follow through with the F-35, flying it or um, working with an ally that's that's working uh, with Russian systems, particularly air defense systems, with with one of our, what I would say is probably one of our most advanced uh, technological um, capabilities. I'm I'm pleased to hear you say that. The the question I guess I have is I understand that some of the parts for the F-35 are being made in Turkey and what happens to that um, assembly and who picks up that slack if Turkey can't receive the F-35? Well, that's, that's one of the issues that's being considered and will be considered, I'm sure, as you know. But for them, I would just underscore the fact that this is a, this is a huge decision for Turkey, and we've, we've continuously, I've talked to them personally, as many of all of our leadership has, it connects in many different ways uh, to that, uh, to the, to the um, uh, employment and the um, integration that they have within the system itself, the F-35, but also to FMS and other systems that, uh, that we, we sell to Turkey as well. And so I, I, I would hope that they would reconsider this one decision on S-400, one system, but potentially uh, forfeit uh, many of the other systems and, uh, and the most, one of the most important systems that we can provide them. Well, thank you. I share that view. I think Turkey is an important ally, but it's one that we hope to be able to depend on. Um, thank you, Mr. Chairman.